Hello everyone, my name is Dr. Jacobs. I'm a doctor of physical therapy and I'm the inventor of advanced soft tissue release as their specialty. I'm also a cancer survivor and I used to suffer from chronic migraines, headaches, pain and fatigue before I invented Aster specialty. All right, Melissa, tell me what's going on with your headache. So I started having a headache on Saturday, today's Monday, mm -hmm. and I had a headache, like I took Advil on Saturday in the morning, and it kind of got a little better, but not all the way better. Then, then I took two Aleve, and it was still got a little better, but didn't go away. And then I went to bed, and Sunday I woke up, and I still had the headache. So you've been having constant headache for the last three days. Yeah, and it just doesn't okay. go away. And then finally, I took um, Excedrin migra or migraine mm -hmm. yesterday. It didn't work. And then finally, I went to the urgent care because I'm wondering why is this not going away. Mm -hmm. And they gave me a shot, and that helped. But then this morning, I woke up, and it's still just not as bad. I'm a little better, but just sore. Like on the back of my head, my neck. How much headaches from zero mm -hmm. to ten? Ten is emergency room. Like right over the weekend was like five. Mm -hmm. Right now is like three or four, just sore here. Okay. Not as bad, but it's still not. So gone. you feel it coming coming from the back all the way to the front. Kind of, yeah. And do you feel it in your chaps, your yeah, muscles on the sore side? Here yeah. Here and my neck and my. So like up here. Okay. Right so everything we do should be pain free, okay? okay. Alright. So I'm gonna work on it. So. so you feel it's started from the back? Yeah, like back here. Left or right or both are the same. Oops. They're both like the same. Okay. I'll just move your chair a little bit to the side. Yeah. Okay. Put it this way. Yeah, that's good. Right. Wow, you're yeah, very mm -hmm. tight. It's more tightness here, actually. You feel this knot here? You feel this, like, kind of rock hard feeling? Yeah. That's the scar tissue there. Yeah. Yeah, so we're going to cut that. So did it start like in the morning or what yeah. happened? Did you have anything like happen different that's uh, the only thing it? different? I think that I'm trying to get. I have a mattress, but I had a mattress topper that I'm trying to replace. Mm -hmm. And so that's a headache by itself. <laughs> yeah, and I think you know I'm trying to find the right one that hopefully mm -hmm. will. Yeah, it's hard. Yeah. It's hard to find a good mattress or a pillow yeah. or something like that. That's not easy. So I've been trying to do that the last mm -hmm. few weeks. So I'm Man. maybe that's it. I know it's. So you tried different different mattresses, pillow tops yeah. or something like that. Yeah. Well, part of it, like if you feel it in the morning and you did not feel it the night before. Yeah. It's either you have a bad mattress, bad pillow. Mm -hmm. the way you slept or there's some kind of inflammation yeah but uh, if that the change that occur lately it sound like that's uh, like the pillow top over the mattress yeah because you know? yeah, I wake up and my back would, even my back would feel kind of sore I'm like what oh so when that happened that you know that's not the yeah. pillow top yeah that is not yeah. that one yeah uh, don't say like oh it's gonna take a couple of days and I'm gonna get used to it no, no. Yeah. That's the wrong one. Yeah. That's not a good one. <laughs> yeah. So, Melissa, can you give me like a little brief history? Like when I see you several years ago, what, yeah. what was your condition? How Gosh. many treatments? And uh, it was a while ago. <laughs> no, it was when yeah. you were in Mission Viejo. I don't remember yeah. how, many, how long ago that was. It was like at least three, four years ago. Yeah. It was when your babies were born. How yeah, old are they the now? twins. Nah, uh, they are actually close to four now. Yeah. So that's. It was in the fall. Yeah, yes. Yeah. Yeah. And, uh, yeah. Your babies were just born. Yeah. So. Um, that's when it was. So, I had headaches every afternoon, like. Daily headaches. Yes, mm -hmm. and I was always taking medicine. They'd get mm -hmm. better, but every afternoon I'm getting mm -hmm. a headache. I'm like, mm -hmm. what? 
And so... Um, that was four years ago. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And it was just so annoying. And I finally mm -hmm. saw... One of my friends was telling me she... And I don't think she saw you, but she said, Oh, yeah, I've done, like, soft tissue release. I'm like, what? Mm -hmm. Like, what is that? Mm -hmm. So I was looking up... Mm -hmm. You know, people in my area, and you were there, and so I'm like, and when I started going, mm -hmm. like even after the first treatment, mm -hmm. I didn't get a headache for a couple of days, mm -hmm. and then after, I think I only went a couple of treatments or something. Yeah, like that. maybe mm -hmm. a month to mm -hmm. you, and after that, mm -hmm. I didn't have headaches for until now like now. <laughs> okay, so it's uh, it's almost like four years. That's yeah, that, that's yeah. Good. But I improved my posture. And I improve my sleeping posture. Yeah, because you have to do the whole program, you know. Yeah. So yeah, in the video I usually do the manual stuff, but behind the scene we do exercises. We yeah. work on the posture. We work on nutrition. If there is inflammation, we work on that. Stress mm -hmm. management. This yes. is called the biopsychosocial model, that actually proven in a lot of studies. It's it's uh, provide a long term result. Yeah. <coughs> we cannot do just the soft yeah. tissue and you know and leave like leave the bad posture or yeah. bad mechanic. Yeah. Yeah, and I, I um actually I think probably the last time I saw you was when I got that memory thing memory foam and I didn't realize you're supposed to replace it every two years That's or so. That's when you had headache the other time, four years ago? Yeah, I did. I needed a new mattress and everything. And Probably every time you get a new mattress, schedule. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> schedule the treatment. <laughs> yeah, and I, yeah, I'm, I sleep with the pillow between my knees. Mm -hmm. You know, That's and good. I've been yeah. really good about doing my best with that. Do you feel the scar tissue here? Yeah. Do you clench your teeth? Sometimes I have a mouth guard. Mm -hmm. You wear that at night. I try, but sometimes I, in the middle of the night I find myself taking it out. Mm -hmm. Last time did I give you stuff for TMJ? Uh, I don't remember. I'm going to give you some stuff today. Like yeah. Like before that too, so from clenching. Yeah. yeah, but I do mm -hmm. um, have a mouth guard and mm -hmm. I, but the problem is I take it out and then I'll put it back in and then I like it. At night? Yes. I'm so like, that's woke you up. Wow. I, don't, it, I don't know why. Does it fit you well yeah, or you have the problem with that? But why are you taking it off? I, I We're taking like it off. Sometimes after a while, it just bugs me and I take it off. <laughs> I've been doing this for it's like two late. years. That's what you have in the middle of the night. Yeah, I just, I don't know why. So how often do you do that? Like middle of the night, you leave it and... Yeah, sometimes I'll make it through the whole night without. So if you're not wearing it, do you clench? If I'm stressed, I clench. But if mm -hmm. I'm not so stressed, I don't. Okay, I'm going to give you some exercises like for that. Yeah. When... Uh, Carrie, you started seeing Carrie, and I was kind of worried about her. I was clenching. Then. So you start to clench. Yeah. yeah. When mm -hmm. I'm like stressed, I do. But mm -hmm. if I'm not, then I don't. Okay. I still try to sleep with it every night, though. So I will give you some breathing exercises and stuff for stress. So yeah. make sure you manage it without clenching or burning your teeth. But you definitely, when you clench, you need to wear the night guard so yeah. you don't crack your yeah. teeth. It's more expensive to. Fix the teeth. Yeah. Then the card, you know? I've cracked two. Oh, <laughs> you did? My wife cracked one. Yes. Yeah. And so that was so painful. Very bad. Oh my goodness. But, oh, yeah. yeah. Sorry about that. That's not fun. No. Okay. How about now? Do you feel any difference? My shoulders, yes. Let's move your neck. Oh. Left right. We should have done that. That's so much better. Do you still feel heavy or it's gone? And extend to back and forward. Still a little bit sore, but I can feel like I can move now. You move further, but you feel a little yeah. bit tightness. Okay, still a little bit, but I'm. You're gonna better, feel cold. Yeah. Let's put your hair on the side. You feel cold. You know. Yeah, I don't know. Yeah, oh. it helped a lot. So people can have headaches that last, like... If they do not get treatment... For that I had, long? Oh, I, I saw a patient, like, had headaches for years. I personally used to have migraines mm -hmm. for years, and I was just popping medication like candy. 
yeah. until I get to the point this is not working. Yeah. And that's what made me start to work on headache and have recall for headache mm -hmm. because I tried it all. And <coughs> this is an it has to be holistic biopsychosocial model. Yeah. You know, we have to work on the scar we have to work on the scar tissue, the fascia restriction, the ergonomic, nutrition, inflammation, mm -hmm. because headache is a very complex condition that it's not like it's not there's no magic uh, element. Yeah. You have to address the all all the deficits that occur because that cause headache, mm -hmm. you know. So that's when I realize I have. So I did not have migraine for the last like five or six years. Yeah. You know, great. because I was working on my nutrition. I released mm -hmm. the scar tissue, released the fascia, worked on my fascia, mm -hmm. had inflammation. I worked on that the stress. I did some meditation and breathing exercises. Mm -hmm. <laughs> because it's a very complex condition. Yeah. And it depends on the patient compliance. So if the patient is not compliant, it doesn't matter how much work we're gonna do with them. Sure. You know, because they continue eating the food that causes the trigger or you know, doing the bad posture that causes the trigger. Yeah. So Yeah, that was <laughs> that was hard for me to change. It was the hard posture. To change, yes. Yeah, because remember when we when I worked with you, it's I actually it posture. was not the symptoms that we were working on. Yeah. I saw you for months, but not because you had symptoms, but because yeah. we had to work on your posture. You know. Yeah, that was. You remember? I remember. It was hard. It's, it's, you're actually doing very well now. But yeah, it took. It your took posture a while. was like her. Yeah. You know what I mean? It the was. same posture slashing yes. forward like that. Yeah. Yeah, it takes it takes uh, three weeks to change a habit. Yeah, you know? it took so like that, and I remember. That's what usually take time. Just correcting habit, uh, you know, strengthening muscle, working mm -hmm. on the stress, behavior modification, but the release usually does not take a few sessions for yeah. that. You know. Yeah. Okay, so let's move your neck and tell me how that feel. Yeah, much better. Mm hmm. Any headache tightness? Not too much. Can I stand up? Yeah, yeah, you because can. Earlier, like, I'd stand up and I'd feel worse. Oh, okay. Let me see. Um, this is so much better. I would say, like, there's a, still a tiny bit of soreness here and here. How but much from 0 to 10? Okay, you feel it in, in there and in the back. In back. Okay, yeah. let's have a seat. Mm -hmm. You can facing the camera here. Turn around. Okay. Mm -hmm. You can move the chair. Okay. Behind your eyes, yeah? A little bit and still back right here. Okay, let's um, yeah. let just work on this. Okay. Sorry, I'm missing through here. That's okay. Yeah. Did you have any trauma here? When I was 19, I was in a car accident. Mm -hmm. I had like whiplash. So I feel, I feel a scar tissue in your head here, mm -hmm. in this area. Feel that? Yes. From here. Where did you hit your head? It was more like a whiplash. Okay, just the front? Yeah, I had my seatbelt on. Mm -hmm. And um... And that's here. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Okay. Do you feel all those bumps here? Yeah. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Sorry. That's okay. Is that I'm too much? Or? No. That's good. Because you, even you had the head in the front, you hit your head in the back. Yeah. In, uh, yeah. In the seat, you know. So usually patient gets scar tissue either front and yeah. back. That's if the, the, the accident front, mm -hmm. front head. If it's a side head, it's going to be the side. Yeah. You know. Can you hear that? Mm -hmm. yeah. This is from clinching actually the scar tissue here in the temporalis and the Probably, yeah. yeah. That's from clinching from more in here. I know when 
you started seeing Carrie in January. Mm -hmm. My husband, he knew I was kind of stressed out. Mm -hmm. And he's like, you should just go at the same time. And I'm you like, should say something. And I'm like, no, it's okay. I, 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 I remember fine. this time you looked as stressed, but I did not say anything. And I'm like, no, I'll be okay. And then she got better, and I was okay. But yeah, I think yeah. it still builds up over time. Let me know if it's too much, okay? Keep your eyes closed, okay? Mm -hmm. Too much? Mm, a little bit, sure. Sure, sure, sure. Okay. Too much? Mm, it's okay. Do you have any uh, allergies or anything like that? Not too much, mm -hmm. just seasonal, but mostly in the fall. Mm -hmm. Want to make sure you drink enough water. Yeah, I brought my there. bottle in the car. So how does this feel now? Much better. In the back and the front, do you feel anything? No, we just have that point. Sure, yeah. Mm -hmm. Any headaches? We need to give you some water. Just a little tiny bit sore back here, but not that bad. Where? Where all the bumpy was right here. Yeah, you just feel like the pressure or just headache? Mm, I need to get... a little sore. A little sore over there? From 0 to 10, how much? So like, like a 1 or a little less than 1. Okay. Not too bad. Your eyes feel better though. Your eyes feel better? Yeah. Okay, so let me get to this. Okay, it's right in here, you feel it? Yeah. And here. Mm -hmm. I don't have well, if I give you water now, it's good for you to do this. Mm -hmm. Do you drink enough water? I try to. I like that hint water. Mm -hmm. What's hint water? What is it? It's just, it, there's no flavors. They, it, there's no like artificial anything. It's just mm -hmm. water. You can get it at Whole Foods. Mm -hmm. um, do they like, put something on? They have like a flavor. Yeah, there's like it's flavored water. Like they have strawberry or. You can Mine. do it. I know, and I do sometimes. You can do it very easy. I if do it in the refrigerator. Hint, yeah. You know, just I have do. your water, a few drops of lemon. Yeah. Or you know, just put a piece of fruit. Yeah, I do you that. You know, and eat the fruit at the end. That's more natural than anything. Yeah. Because you really don't For know sure. how much like and what they do, and you have to have it refrigerated because it yeah. will go bad. Yeah. You know. Yeah. So yeah, your flush is really tight here. You feel that. Yeah. Can you just a little here, sorry. Mm -hmm. just a little right here a little bit too? Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Feel it? Mm -hmm. Don't want more on it next time. Okay. But you feel a little bit tight this here, so you don't feel sure. So I must have had a tension headache then. Yeah, it's a think? tension headache. Well if it's it's this tight? Yeah. Well tension headache that's very typical with what you have. Because mm -hmm. all this this tightness and mm -hmm. when you feel better after this treatment, this is this is like classic tension headache. Yeah. Because with Aster, just it's easy to work on the tension headache. Mm -hmm. You know, migraine it takes a few sessions yeah. too. But we have to do a lot of different things. Um, you know, nutrition mm -hmm. and yeah, stuff, yeah. other stuff. But tension headache is uh, usually scar tissue, fascia restrictions around mm -hmm. this area. So tell me how this feel. Yeah, much better. Mm -hmm. Like it my head. Yeah. Any headache? So how how you feel now? Much better. All right. So what yes. do you think about the Aster treatment? It's amazing. Yeah. Yes. Awesome. Thank goodness I'm, I've been able to come. Yeah. I was kind of worried last night. I was like, what's wrong? Because you have three days and, I know, and I was you tried so everything cool. and even the urgent care. I can't believe they give you a shot. <laughs> It's the first I time. No, because I. Yeah. Because I, I was thinking, what's wrong? This is. What's never right? You tried everything. This yeah. I tried every medicine. Yeah. It's not going away. But here is the problem with the tension headache. Tension headache medication will not gonna work because it's usually scar tissue and fascia restrictions. Yeah. So if you don't have mechanical force to release it, it's 
Yes. Medication will it just you're not gonna feel the tightness for yeah. until the medication wears yeah. out. Yeah. You know, but you have to have mechanical force to release it. Yeah. You know. Oh, no, no. Yeah. No, this is better. Thank you. Yeah, you're welcome. Yeah. Thank you so much. Yeah. yeah. Thank you. Feel free to subscribe to my channel to get helpful tips on how to relieve pain. And if you are a healthcare provider and interested to be ASTER certified, uh, you can follow the link below. Uh, you will get information on how to register for Aster online class. Uh, there is over uh, 40 studies that support Aster treatment model, and also there is uh, over uh, 400 studies that utilize by Aster treatment. And feel free to check over more over 220 videos that most of them actually real treatment videos. Uh, we'll see you soon.